Gorgeous people, this is Amazars DIY and other stuff. My name is Amber Meeks, and in today's video, I have my February Heroes Tower mystery box. For those of you who don't know what the Heroes Tower is, it is a geeky subscription box that I got from Cratejoy. They have a plethora of options available. The box that I'll be unboxing today is catered towards my likes. But if you don't see what you like in the selections they have on the site, reach out to them because there is a possibility they can customize a box for the things that you like. Okay, guys, so we will have the craft challenge results for the month of February. So I'm really excited to share those with you. Can't wait to see what Chad made and I can't wait to show you guys what I made. So without further ado, let's jump into this thing. Okay guys, so woo, here's my box. Can't wait to see what's inside here. I look forward to this every single month. Oh, there's something outside the packaging. Let's check this guy out. Just first, oh, it's like, it's like a Oh, what do you call those round things? Well, it's like an egg, really. But it's Batman! How cute is it? It's a stuffed Batman. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I love it. Guys, my geeky area is getting super awesome with all of this super cool stuff that I keep getting. This is so cute. I love it. Adorable. Okay, guys. So they... Oh, what's this? Oh, this is the... Um, what's in here? Okay, guys. So... Here is the flyer that I get in there every single month. They will have a item list coming soon. He does provide that for me, but I'm pretty sure he's not providing that in all of the boxes at this time, but it's coming in the future. Okay, so where, oh, there's something else outside this thing, guys. Let's just dig right in. Spider-Man. Okay, I'm looking at Batman, but <laughs> the thing is, is I have this little Spider-Man section that I'm working on. So now I have some Spider-Man stickers that I can do some super cool stuff with. So here's those. Definitely excited to have those. I'm working on like, I don't know, I guess I'm trying to make it look like, I don't know, like different rooms in a house in my geeky area. I can't explain it for each like Marvel character. <laughs> I don't know. I thought that would be fun. Okay, guys. So it's all bubble wrapped up here. Let's go ahead and take the little bubble wrap off and see what's inside. Craft item challenge. We'll save that guy. Ooh, we got more Batman stuff. The erasers. <gasps> That's cool. Okay, guys. I have an idea for these. Like, I already have an idea for these. I didn't even see them, and I had an idea as soon as I saw they were erasers. Look how cool those are, guys. Yes, please. I know most people don't get excited about erasers, but you guys know me. I sure do. <laughs> that is super cool. All right, that's going to look awesome. Ooh, stop it. I have a Batman pin that says Gotham City. I'm Batman. I can't. I love it. Oh, my gosh. I love it. Look at that. <gasps> Guys, that is so super cool. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited about that. That is so cool. We got a whole little Batman theme going on. I love it. Okay, guys, let's see what else we got in here that's super fun. So here is um, the postcard and some other super fun things. Looks like we have some paper clips that are really cool looking. So let's pop this open and see what we got inside here. So with the postcard that he sends every single month, guys, he does provide the postage stamp so that you're able to send somebody a geeky hello. So, the, oh, it's a Christmas one. Stop it. That is so cute. It's a He-Man with She-Ra Christmas postcard. I can't. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't. I Love that. That is awesome. I love it. And then I also got a Superman one. So bonus. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is so awesome, guys. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. I actually have an idea for this stuff. I know I've said that many times, but I've actually started working on the idea. So you guys are going to see it very soon. Okay. I'm going to use the postcards along with those four by six art prints that I get in my Kale Off and a monthly subscription. It's going to be super cool. All right. Let's see what else we have in here. Boo, boo, boo. Boo, boo, boo. So what, who are they though? I don't know who they all are. Oh, we got Spider-Man and I don't know who all these other ones are, but they're super cute. So look guys, these are little, um, what are these called? I can't even think. 
Oh my gosh. But it's those. There you go. Why can't I think of these? Paper clips. Oh my gosh. Out of control. Now, I don't know who these characters are, but that's okay. They're still super cute and I will totally use them because they are so darling. I love the purple one. And then there's this guy right here. Again, not sure who that guy is. I mean, I know Spider-Man, but I don't know any of this other stuff. And then there's this lady here. So... Very cool. We'll definitely use all of them, and I think that they are super adorable. Okay, what else we got here? Oh, so fun, guys. I have one of these Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle bags that he made for me. Look how cute these are. So, look, this is awesome that I have another one, though. I promise you I'm super stoked to have another one because I have been storing all my little trinkets that I haven't gotten to yet to work on stuff, and it's super full, guys. So, now I have another one that I can add to my little geeky area. It's a decorative way to store your crafting stuff Loving it. Thank you so much. This is super cute. And by the way, guys, this is a handmade item. Love it. So cute. All right. Oh, I didn't expect that. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Okay, guys, check this out. I do not have anything Catwoman. Nada. This is going to be awesome in my geeky section. I have a Catwoman figurine. Look at it, guys. Stop it. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. So you know I got to open this up, guys. I have to. So let me go ahead and pause the video. I'm going to open this up and then I'll come back and show it to you outside of the packaging because I don't store things in my geek area in the packaging. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Sorry about that, but I had to open this for you guys. Check her out. Yay. So she has accessories. I'm going to show her to you without her accessories. So here she is. Here's the back as well. Loving it, loving it. I'm so excited to have a Catwoman, guys. This is so cool. Okay, so here's some of her accessories, the little hand things here. Super cute. Loving that. And then, oh, I don't even know how this goes. But here's another accessory. Sorry, guys. I'm sure, like, it probably goes that way when it's on her. But I'm just going to show it to you guys this way. And then I also have this. Yay! So that is so super awesome. Yay! Thank you, Chad. Okay, so next I'm going to do the craft challenge. So we'll go ahead and start with Chad's item, and then we'll show you my items. I made two this time. And um, th what we had was a little bag of goodies. I'm sure I'll pop it up somewhere for you guys to show you guys what we had to work with. So he made something with a little bag of goodies, and I did too. So let's go ahead and see what Chad made. So here's the craft item challenge that Chad made with his little bag of goodies. Let's see what he came up with. Stop it. Ooh, there's a card in here. What's the card? Ooh, I don't know. Okay, guys. <laughs> this is so cool. You know why this is so cool? Because like I said, I'm working on this whole little Spider-Man area. This is going to be perfect. Okay, so here's this. So fun. Look at that, guys. I love it. I can't. This is going to be so super fun. I have this area carved out, and this is going to be so great for that area. Then he also made this one here. It's got like a whole scene background, and then he put the 3D stickers on top of it. Super cool. I don't know what's in the envelope, so let's go ahead and check what is in the envelope. Oh, stop it. He made a card. Oh, that is so cool. So... Sorry, guys. Nobody's going to get this card. I'm probably going to put it with that super cool Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle one that he made for me a little while back. But check it out. Oh, what a great idea. I love it. He did awesome with the stuff. Oh, okay. I thought that was. And then it's just blank on the inside, guys. So I can write somebody a note and give them the super cool card. Sorry, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to put it in my decor. Chad, you did awesome with the challenge items. And I'm so super excited to have all the really cool Batman, Superman stuff. So Batman, Superman, you know what I meant. Okay, so let's go ahead and show you what I made with the stuff. I had a bag of goodies that had some Transformers stuff in it. It had some Spider-Man stuff in it. And then I think the other one was anime. The only thing I didn't work with was the anime stuff. I'm probably going to give that to my niece so that she can work with that stuff because she likes that kind of thing. Okay, so I'll go ahead and show you the uh, Transformer one first. So Jean from her channel is called Pinky Jean now. If you guys don't know Jean, make sure you check her out. She sent me this little Transformer kit thing. And as soon as I saw the Transformer cards, I knew I wanted to use them on the kit. And here's what I made. Yay! 
Yay! So I know this probably looks like nothing, you guys. Okay, she stuck some stickers and a couple of cards on the background. But guys, this looks so super cool when you put it with something. So I'm going to pop a picture up of how it's displayed, it, how it's going to be displayed in my geeky area with a super cool uh, Optimus Prime figurine that um, Chad sent to me, one of my Hero Star mystery boxes. And then I have another um, Transformer one that I bought myself and a bumblebee one. So this is such a cool backdrop for things like that. So I am super excited that uh, Jean sent this to me so that I could create something like this to beef up that geeky area and make it look really cool. Here's the two cards that Chad sent to me that I used in this DIY. If you want to call it a DIY. I'm just showing you guys simple ways you can beef up your geeky area if you're a geek like me. All right. So then the other thing that he sent me was a Spider-Man set of stuff. So I went ahead and made a little picture with it. So I had the same idea that he did. I just used um, a rogue piece of wood and then I mod podged a spider scene on the back and then I put the little sticker or it wasn't a sticker it was a piece of paper I mod podged it on then out of the two little stickers I'm gonna put this on an easel in my geeky area along with the other two things that Chad made I'm pretty sure we're all winners in this I don't know how you can pick who's the best because we made very similar things here's Chad's super cool stuff that he made you know I'm gonna put it how cool is this gonna be oh my gosh my Spider-Man area is going to be out of this world. So we did very similar things. Actually, oh, I think his might be magnets. Oh, they are. His are magnets. <gasps> but I might not put them in a magnet area. His are magnets, guys. But I might not use them for magnets. <laughs> I'm just saying. They're super cool magnets, but I need more beefed up stuff for my geek area. So I might use it in there. All right, Chad, you did an awesome job. Loved it, loved it, loved it. So he already pre-sent me the... Um, the items that we're going to use for this month's craft challenge. So I'm going to share that with you right now. So this is for March and April. So this is for, uh, I have this little set of stuff that I'm going to use for March and for April, the April challenge. So here's the rules. The rules are March and April challenge, make two items out of tr the Transformers grab bag. So I have a Transformers grab bag. I'm going to show you guys what's in it here in a second. So I have one item for March and another for April. There's no rules, no help. Good luck. <laughs> I love you, Chad. You're so awesome. Okay. So here's what it is, guys. I have this little Transformers grab bag thing. So this is what I have to work with for my March and my April challenge. So let's go ahead and pop this open so I show you guys what kinds of things, can you hear me, I have in here. <laughs> so we have markers. Should I try to do something with the markers? I'm just saying. I probably could. All right. Uh, what else? Let's see what other fun stuff. Let's get to the meat of the potato, so to speak, right? Let's see what fun stuff I have to work with in this little kit here. Make sure I got it all out. Okay, I did. Okay, so we have some super cool stickers. Oh, yes, this is going to be fun, guys. All right, so look, I have all these really cool stickers to work with. No, I won't make the same thing as what you just saw. It'll be something completely different. Actually, these stickers are nice, small, and condensed. I might have a really cool idea. So, awesome. And then I have, ooh, what's happening here? Okay, so I have these pop-outs. I guess you're supposed to color these pop-out things, which is cool with the marker, but I probably won't do that. I'll probably beef it up a little bit more and make it a little bit more exciting, but I'll have to brainstorm on what I'm going to do with these because, like, as I just told you guys, I'm working on a whole area for all this kind of stuff, so this is going to be fun. So what I'll do is I'll do something um, with these pop-ups one month, and then the next month I'll do something with the stickers. So that's how I'm going to treat this little grab bag that he gave to me for my um, craft uh, challenge items. So guys, <laughs> no ideas or anything like that, but look forward to what we're going to make next month because I can tell you right now, I have a really good idea for those stickers and I don't think you guys want to miss it. Again, guys, this was the Heroes Tower Mystery Box. You can find it on CrateJoy. I'll have a link to their um, CrateJoy subscription box in the description box below. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video, guys, and I'll catch you in my next one. Bye! What's up, gorgeous people? This is Zambazar's DIY, and you really can't see my shirt very good. I wonder if I come down just a little bit more. Hold on. The Heroes Tower. So this is the month of February's box. So, hold on. I lost track of what I was going to say. That's why I kept saying so. Bargain. <laughs>
Okay, guys, so that didn't work. Try again.